And there are calls across Maine for a political intervention after the state's controversial governor went on a tirade, unleashing obscenities on a lawmaker's voicemail. Governor Paul LePage left an explicit message for Congressman Drew Gatteen after he got the impression that Gatteen had called him a racist. Let's just say snot-nosed little runt was the least offensive phrasing that the governor used. Jim Axelrod reports. 95% of this state is white. Even for Maine Governor Paul LePage, never shy about speaking his mind, the obscene voicemail he left a state legislator yesterday was stunningly blunt. Mr. Gatine, this is Governor Paul Richard LePage. I would like to talk to you about your comments about my being a racist, you sucker. The two-term Republican governor exploded after a reporter told LePage that Democratic State Rep Drew Gatine had criticized him for saying Wednesday that 90% of drug dealers arrested in Maine are, quote, black and Hispanic people from out of state, a figure he cites using his own personal collection of headlines culled from newspapers. I want you to prove that I'm a racist. I have spent my life helping black people, and you little son of a socialist sucker, you, I need you to, this freaking, I want you to... Record this and make it public because I am after you. No, I did not call Governor Plager racist. Gatine says he called those remarks racially charged, but never called the governor a racist. I was really glad that I wasn't in the room with him when he left it, because he really sounded like somebody who, you know, was, was about to commit physical violence. And, and it was really a, a stunning message. This afternoon, LePage apologized for the people of Maine having to hear the voicemail, but not for the voicemail itself. Everything I said to him is less insulting to me than being called a racist. After leaving the voicemail, LePage then said he wanted to challenge Gatine to a duel and point his gun, quote, right between his eyes. Today, he backed off that, saying it was simply a metaphor and that he meant no physical harm. Tony? 